What's up guys, welcome to the vlog. Today we're going to my sister's high school graduation and the paper said that we're not supposed to bring any umbrellas but we can wear hats. So, I got this umbrella hat right here. We'll see what they make us do later. It's about to go down. So I got in and not only did I get to wear this, I got to sit in the front because I sprained my ankle. So I got VIP seating. My parents are somewhere up there. Oh, there? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's Alisa. Alisa. Shaky, my arm tired. Down. Yeah. Alisa, where you at? So many people. Uh, I look at Casey Neistat. No, I do. Hey Lisa, how do you feel? You graduated today. <laughs> <laughs> what's your What's your YouTube channel? It's a win-win situation, but win like my last name win. Yeah, it's my sister. So hopefully now I can get more subscribers. Oh yeah. I'm gonna say to all the family members that couldn't make it. I'm gonna say to mom and dad. What? I'm gonna say mom and dad. Oh, love you. Thank you for driving me everywhere. How about me? Thanks for taking all my pictures, bro. You're welcome. Show them the face I made. Show them the face I made you. Look at this. Isn't that nice? Thank you for Jonathan. Though. So today is International. Is it International Donut Day or just National Donut Day? It is just National Donut Day. So they have free donuts. Everybody's here. I am. Oh. Oh, okay. well. I thought you'd see from here. Oh. These donuts going up and down. So I'm heading to the gym for the first time in two weeks now. I've been sick with a sinus infection and I sprained my ankle playing Ultimate Frisbee two weeks ago. So now I'm feeling healthy enough to go. Made it to the gym. I made it to the gym. I don't have a membership. My membership expired, so to get a guest pass. So I went to the nearby LA Fitness to get my gym membership, but they said I already got a gym pass, a guest membership a while ago, so they wouldn't give me one today. But it didn't make any sense. I drove all the way just to get this membership. Man, so today I'm at 24 Hour Fitness. What ended up happening yesterday was that I called LA Fitness for a guest pass and they said that I was cleared for one. So I drove across town just to get a free guest pass, a five day guest pass. And once I got there, they said that I already had one from a different location 20 miles away a few months ago. So I couldn't get one today, which doesn't make any sense because if you go to a different location, it's not the same thing as the as one near your house. So I couldn't get a guest pass. So I ended up going to a 24 hour fitness across town just to get a three-day membership because I'll be leaving uh, for the summer for my summer internship. What up guys? Um, right now I'm about to go to the airport to catch my flight. Uh, I'm going from LAX to Dulles International in DC. So if I drive there and check in because my flight's at 11 and it's like 8.30 right now. So we're going to the airport now. I'm here with my sister aka win-win situation. <laughs> Shine a light on my, my vlog. Um, my flight's at 11.30, it's like 8.15 now, so we have lots of time. We gotta get some gas first. Anything you wanna say? You gonna miss me, Lisa? Yeah. Yeah? A lot? Yeah. 
you take care of Aurora? Yeah. Aurora's my car. She's gonna drive my car when I'm away, so. If you're any dents in it, Lisa, you're gonna have to pay. Okay. 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 Bye. Bye. Hey guys, I just got through security. Now I'm waiting at my uh, terminal, just waiting to get my flight. Um, if you're wondering, I'm flying United Airlines because the tickets are super cheap now. Um, you couldn't see earlier, but I couldn't fit my jacket in my suitcase, so I'm wearing it with my shorts. You can see right here. Um, so yeah, they're kind of funny, but you know, I'm gonna bring that Cali swag to DC. Fight Club. Fight Club. Just landed in DC. Um, it's about a six hour flight and I slept about half of it so it's pretty much like a three hour flight but it was a pretty smooth flight no major incidents until the end when one of the passengers started cussing out another passenger before we touched down so that was really interesting but the flight attendants did a really good job and they broke it up so now we're here now I just gotta get my baggage claim and I get an uber to my apartment so I got my own private shuttle yeah it's going to baggage claim here so you can see on the outside this things coming in and out all right guys just got outside of baggage claim now I'm waiting for an uber ride I'm kind of scared to see what's gonna happen but uh, I'm really excited for this trip I never traveled alone before I'm going to my apartment, I'm going to meet my new roommates and get my stuff ready to get set in. So it's going to be exciting. I'm looking forward to it. Hope to see you guys soon. What's up guys? I'm uh, going to my apartment right now. I just checked in and I uh, wanted to share with you guys what it looks like. So this place is really nice, really new. Um, a lot of new facilities, a lot of new amenities. I'm really excited about this. So wait till you see what my card can do right here. What? Welcome to my crib. This got a really nice view here. Beautiful trees. Out of nothing. Wait till you see the kitchen. It's all wood. And I am room B. Just gotta use my card. Goes in. It's my room right here. Yeah, so my bed is right here. And my bags. Get this thing. My clothes in. My luggage. Then. Room. Basic necessities. Toilet. And then uh, an outside sink right here. Um, my other roommates who haven't moved in yet. And then we got our own shower room. So, oh, the lights went off. Here we go, back on. And it looks like this. Let's see right here. It's a one person shower. But yeah. I'm here in Tenley Town taking the metro. It's a really long escalator. So, we'll see. It's like a minute ride down. Today's my first day. I want to make sure that I know everything that's going on before I start my first day of my internship. So I'm trying to buy my Metro Pass um, and then take that route and explore the city, get acquainted with it. So I'm here in the Metro, going to Bethesda. Um, Shady Grove tram is coming right here. So I'm gonna get on this one and try to find my work spot before uh, it gets too late. This is a red line train to Shady Road. So the metro's pretty empty right now because uh, this is not during rush hour. This is like 2 o'clock. Um, I'm here early and I'm avoiding rush hour, so it's really empty right now. Let's see. So, so I got one more stop till I reach my destination. What's up, everybody? 
everybody. Uh, I just got back from town after exploring the city. I wanted to make sure that I knew the routes to my work before I started tomorrow. So I went around town and it was actually really hot today. It was about like 95 degrees. And it's pretty empty because everyone's at work. But when I did walk around people, something I did notice was that I was the only Asian person here. So every time uh, someone saw me, they would do a double take or, or be act really surprised. Their face would show that they're surprised when they walk by me. So um, it's exciting being the only Asian person in town. I look forward to representing my people and representing the 626 in the District of Columbia. Um, so every four years I'll get to participate like an Olympic athlete and come back. I think it's 5 o'clock right now in DC and it's still hot. I'm going to eat right now in the dining hall. It opens at 5 and closes at 7.30 and it's an all-you-can-eat buffet. So that means I have two and a half hours to stuff myself and eat as much as I can. So I'm in the dining hall now and as you can see behind me it's extremely crowded. You see all my friends at my table. And I'm so popular that all the girls want to sit with me. So. It's pretty good that it's empty because I get to eat as much as I want. I'm trying to eat healthy for the next two months, so I'll see what I can do with cafeteria food. But it looks pretty healthy right now. If you look right here, so you got my salads, my natural carbs, I got my proteins, my eggs right here, got some more veggies, chicken pot pie right here, my fruit. If I get some more fruit later. So hey guys, I uh, just woke up. It's 7.15 right now, DC time, and I start my internship at 9. Today's my first day, so I'm gonna try to get there a little bit early and make sure I don't get lost and don't come in late. <laughs> See you guys in a bit. What's up guys? So today is the first day of my internship. Um, I've almost took the wrong route to work, but I found the right way and I'll still make it early on time. So it's a lot of... <coughs> A lot of people today. Um, I'm excited to start my first day and and see what my internship is going to be like. So stay tuned, and I'll see you guys after work. So about to walk into my office now. Um, I said this is my work area, and then this is where I'm going to be going in. So wish me luck. So guys, just came back to my apartment after finishing the first day of my internship. I was really scared coming into work. I didn't know if I'd be a good fit or if you know the culture would be right, but it was it was really uh, nice meeting everyone there. I think the people were, were genuinely nice and, and really welcoming. They encouraged us to ask a lot of questions, and I work with a fellow intern who plays volleyball at Dartmouth, and she's really nice too. So I thought today was a really good first day, despite all the, the problems I had with you know onboarding from my computer. But uh, I'm really looking forward to tomorrow because that's when the real work starts. So right now I'm about to go to the gym. I'm trying to stay healthy during my time in DC. Right, we'll see how that goes though. <sighs> Just finished the gym. Going back to my apartment now. I wanted to record at the gym, but it's kind of awkward because I already stand out and have all these people watching me and to record in front of them just makes it even worse. So I just gotta get used to that and get get adjusted. So once once I feel comfortable enough, comf comfortable enough, I'll start filming again. But Right now I can't even speak, I'm just tired. So guys, so today is my second day on my internship. Just got to the metro, now I'm waiting for it to get to work. Um, I don't know what to expect today, but I think today is when the real work starts, so we'll see what happens. I don't get time to record in the mornings because I'm rushing to work, and then once again the shuttle is kind of crowded, and people feel awkward without cameras. So I try to wait till I like, find a good time where there's no one around me, but I guess I just gotta get used to it and get comfortable with filming. I guess I already get used to it too. <laughs> this fam coming right here. Yeah. Alright, see you guys later. So I just finished the second day of my internship, went to the gym, and now I'm going to dinner. I don't know how I'm gonna vlog different places each day because I feel like I'm just going to work and then going to the gym every day. But. Maybe if I go out at night or go to dinner in town, then I'll record. So for now, I'm um, just going to the bus stop and take a shuttle to uh, Tenley Town and get some food. Cool thing about my apartment is that it's right across the, the Department of Homeland Security. So, like, at least I have an office for it. So, 
So behind me are the Nebraska apartments where I live. And you see all these cars, all this traffic behind me. And on the other side right here is Department of Homeland Security. So uh, yeah, everything's pretty close to one another in DC. And right now, just walking to the shuttle. Trying to get some food. I think I'm gonna lose some weight because I haven't consumed as many calories as I usually do because money is tight and food is expensive. So uh, I might lose all the gains that I've accumulated. But that's okay, I'll probably get it back later. I'm sorry that the video quality is kind of shaky. I usually film when I walk around town and my arm shakes a lot. I'm using an iPhone because my sister's DSLR camera is at home. So I hope this quality isn't too bad. What's up guys? So it's been a busy week. I just finished the first week of my internship and just finished up with the gym. Now I'm going to my apartment to shower before I go to town with my friend. Probably going to check out a few uh, restaurants and bars and see what DuPont has to offer. So I'm really excited for that. I'm just so relieved that the week's over and now uh, I get a chance to relax and just reflect on the week. I had a really good time. I, I got along with all the people at my internship and they're really nice to me. So I'm really excited about that. This guy just stopped right here on, on the road and this guy honked him. Where is he? Another guy honked. This guy stopped. So yeah, now I gotta cross the road. See you guys. So it's the end of the week. Tonight is Friday night and I'm here with my roommate. You wanna be on it, Ethan? Sure. This is Ethan, my roommate. What's up, guys? AKA Baltimore's finest. <laughs> We're here getting burgers and maybe going out to town later. So I'll show you guys what the burgers look like in a bit. But until then, you guys. <laughs> Dude, look at my burger. I got a creamsicle shake right here. And a bison burger, burger mug with a fried egg. Look at this. The lighting's not that good. Look at that. My roommate got the same thing too. Same exact burger he got. Burger and drink. Great minds think alike. Dude, where we at, Ethan? You scream, motherfucker. This is U Street. And it's raining outside. It's like 80 degrees. But it's packed. Crowded. It's like a super long line. Like now we gotta go to the back. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. See? Look at this. There's an ambulance outside of the. Always a good sign. <laughs> that means it's a good place to, to go out. It's safe. I haven't been able to record much because it's been kind of dark inside. So this is like our the best lighting we've had tonight. Plus, it's kind of weird to bring a camera in and like record when people are in there. It's like, yeah, it's kind of weird. Yeah, we out here, bro. We out here. We out here. We out here. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? Shout out. Shout out, Kazar, bro. Kazar, okay. <laughs> so we got in. We went downstairs. Some guy bought us a drink earlier. Stupid. Now we're at the top. Now we're on the rooftop game. Rooftop. Oh, that means last call. Last call? Yeah, uh, cool. last call. Yo, you should bring in this view. So, we got to the top. And this is U Street, right here. I'm more than happy to share. Okay. So, right now, we're going to uh, Chinatown, or gallery place. We're going to, we're going to eat first, and then do what? Check out the place, we walk around. We just found out the museum for free. Yeah. And uh, I got these things today, so maybe you can see my snatch and what's going on. But yeah, it's gonna be a fun day. Oh yeah. We woke up like at like 12, and we got back at 4. We were, we were studying really hard in uh, the library on campus. So yeah, today's a day to have fun. Gallery place just got off the metro. Had some issues with uh, getting off the metro because my car didn't work, but we're here now. In Chinatown. So we're here at Ann Pizza. It costs 10 to be five for pizza, but these pizzas are long, as you can see here. See, this is my arm, like, it's that long. It's crazy. Look at this unbox right here. Oh man, that's crazy. Look at this. 
It's like one of the nicest pizza shops ever. They even have a bar, so we're upstairs. We'll walk this way. This is a bar right here. Just walking out. Yeah, all these uh, all these people laugh or look funny when they look at you funny when you record things. So that's something I'm trying to get accustomed to. But like I said, it's one of the nicest pizza shops ever. This is the second level. Just walk downstairs. It's painting, and then going down to the first floor. This wall, this big mural right here on the side. Let's see right here. But yeah. Going to the White House now. Going to the White House here. Now we're in Freedom Plaza. It's a really nice area. You can see behind me. Look at this. So much stuff. Just making our way there. It's really hot right now. It's like, what, 90 degrees, Ethan? Oh, definitely. It's hot as shit. <laughs> we're almost there to see the orange guy. We'll be there in a bit. So crowded. Even the trees are closed off. So we're here at the White House. You can see a national monument on the other side. But they gated it off, so like you can't get the normal access up to the front gate. Um, but we're trying to go to the other side and see if we get a better picture. There's, there are people on the roof. Maybe there's an event going on. We're not sure. It's really crowded right now. Everyone got kind of clustered in here. But stay tuned. You see the people on the roof right here. Oh, a finger. A whole bunch more people earlier, but it went off the roof. So we know where it went now. So we just got here to the other side of the White House. Then now they're blocking it off behind me. You see that? Look, they're clearing everybody out. Oh, now they're clearing everybody out. Look at this. Maybe he's uh, coming outside the White House. He's coming this way. Oh, yeah, you want to be on it too? Nah, <laughs> okay. What are the glasses? These are Snapchat the glasses. Get out. Yeah, so like I can film stuff through here too. Get the hell. So if anything goes that really? goes down today, yeah. If we get beat up, then you know it's on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't happen. Nice meeting you guys. Hey. Let's see. Maybe there's a motorcade or something. Yeah, this is the entrance or something. So they cleared out the whole road. Everyone's on the sidewalk now. Hey, Ethan. I dare you to run out there. <laughs> Watch what you say. Out here, the single person protest. Uh, all these people right here behind us. I'm just trying to get a good picture, man. Oh, look at this. Yeah, Leaving the White House now. It's been uh, interesting seeing them kick out all the people, but uh, got some good photos. How, how was it for you, Ethan? It's okay? Not too bad? Now you gotta find a place to use the restroom. So, uh, something exciting would happen. Yeah. We thought he'd come out of the building or something. Or like a motorcade, but it didn't happen. Yeah, so surprisingly enough, it's hard to find a public restroom in Washington, D.C. Especially next to the White House. But the journey continues. guys so today is Sunday and I just woke up and finished my swim I should have brought my camera down there but uh, I'll probably bring it next time that I go swimming but it's really nice there's like two pools one right here and one right here and I swim in a big pool uh, like a big boy so uh, now I'm kind of hungry and I'm gonna go get some lunch and then tonight I'll probably meet my friend from high school for dinner and and then see how he's doing so I'm here at Tenley Town going to meet my friend tonight um, my friend from high school is going to a school program here in D.C. So 
We're gonna meet up in Adams Morgan and grab dinner and catch up. You see the here the tram coming on right now behind me. It's perfect timing. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So guys, so I'm here with uh, one of Roland's finest. What's up, world? High school, fr high school friend. Oh yeah. You have an Instagram or anything you want to shout out, Jordan? Uh, Caribbean Prince J. Okay. Holla at me. Okay. So we went to high school together. We went to... Roland High School. We went to math class. We had math class together. And we oh, had yeah. psych class together in, in college. It was lit. And now we're in DC together. So... It's <laughs> Yeah, right. so Jordan's gonna do some big things. He's working with the Department of Agriculture. This guy's doing big things. He's yeah. Um, IBM? Yeah. Beast mode. Yeah. <laughs> trying to get a metro, or trying to get Uber back home to, uh, where are we going? Woodley Park, and then we're gonna go home. But yeah, it's been a, a good night catching up. It's been a hell of a day. Yeah, and we'll probably, uh, we'll probably meet back again soon. Oh, definitely. Yeah. yeah. Going down this big ass uh, this escalator. This is probably the biggest escalator I've ever seen in my freaking life like this is bigger than that Disneyland escalator that we all got to go down <laughs> when we park crazy I think I can see maybe uh, we're going this way it's like it doesn't look that bad on camera though like it looks no, worse in real life it's pretty bad you think so it's pretty bad I'm not letting go of this grip <laughs> I'm holding on because I'm not falling see I'm short but this makes it worse because Jordan's tall so like there's no way I can get both of us on this camera. But yeah. Maybe I can uh, We're not even halfway this angle down. around. Huh? We're not even halfway down. How long do you think this takes? Like three minutes? It takes a clean... I don't even want to walk. Because I don't want to trip. And I don't want to fall. We're from California, so we don't like walking on escalators. But in D.C., you're supposed to stay on the right side. Like, I, I mean, it, it makes sense. But, like... Get on the escalator to ride it, not to walk the stairs. See what I don't get is why they don't have stairs, like steps. You know in Vegas they have escalators and stairs. I don't think you'd want to climb this though. You I don't mean, want to, I don't think you want to climb this, but like for smaller ones, I, I get what you're saying. It's like day every day. You're you're wilding my guy. It's a good workout. Yeah, yeah, you might die. I might. But hey, it's like it is a minute, a minute, thirty seconds. I wonder if it's like interesting footage. If you just like go to the next video by now, if there's anything you like, oh, wanna pass? Walking. They're not they're not walking. They're not walking, they they're chilling like us. We're still on this tape. <laughs> you thought you thought it wasn't that bad. We're still on it. Two minutes, a minute fifty. We're still on this tape. And it's not stopping. You see above us, like that's how far we traveled so far. It's not yeah. stopping. 205. We made 230. Yeah, this is like a YouTube video in itself. I know, shit. I think my vlog's gonna be like an hour long. Like my part, the whole first week, I'm gonna put it into one video and pile it. Oh, for sure. But yeah. Okay. 222. Oh, finally, we're finally, finally off. We're finally off. 27, 28, 29, 30. Two, Two minutes, 30 seconds. Wow. Yeah. So. The lesson learned is to walk on the escalator and uh, don't stand there. Yeah, it took a while. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for watching my first vlog. I'm sorry it's taking a little bit longer than expected to upload. I've had some issues with my computer where it won't recognize the files I'm trying to transfer from my phone. Uh, so, so it's been a little bit more difficult than expected uh, to edit, especially when you're missing a lot of files. And my original goal was to film and upload each week. But right now, it's looking more like every two or three weeks based on how my computer has been working. Um, but there's no need to worry. Everything's going to be okay. What you just watched was week zero and week one, before and after I got to D.C. And right now, it's week three. And I'm at Ethan's house in Baltimore celebrating July 4th weekend. So that means there's a whole bunch of awesome footage coming your way from week two and week three that I have to edit and work on. But I'll make sure to get that done as soon as I finish this video. Um... Until then, you know, I hope everyone's doing well. My sister said that I needed a catchphrase to end my videos. So I'm going to say this. Keep chasing your dreams, live with passion, and eat your veggies. See you guys. Love you. Hey, no, no, no.